Good morning and welcome to the channel. Welcome to the first day and where we come to the lot. Check it out, it's currently pouring rain. Not sure how much we'll be able to show you with my camera here. Um, but yeah, this is the first time I've seen the lot and where the cottage is gonna be going. My father, AKA the owner of the building, is here as well. And we're scouting it out, taking a look, getting a bit of a layout of the land and whatnot to see where the, the building and um, a couple other things will be going on the property. Don't know if you can see behind me, but it's mostly bush. Um, I won't be able to show you too much in the rain, but we'll try and poke our head out really quick and you can always see the surrounding area. All right, I got you protected by a snow shovel. Um, take a little look over here. This is my first time seeing it as well, so pretty exciting. In that direction where that fire pit is, is the where the road is and where the laneway is. And just where that fire pit is, and a bit before it will be where the building will be, the 35 by 35 cottage. Behind us we got just bush surrounding us. It's quite rocky ground. And in this direction we've got one neighbor. That's not the neighbor, that's my dad. And that's the little shed there. Where we have some supplies. This will be that white 3x3 uh, container will be my water supply for most uh, of the mixing and whatever I have to do, cleaning and stuff. So we got some of that. And yeah, we've got some line strung up here to for to where the cottage will be um, I don't know if you can see them on the camera or not but just to get an idea of how big it will be and what space it'll take up all right my arm is already exhausted so I'm gonna put you down and catch you later back in the car bye Got the building permit here, we're gonna tack it up so it's uh, inside of the road. Make this official. You think this one's good? Let's do this. All right, that's it for us here. We can't do too much in the rain. We've laid out where we want the building to be, fit in between some rocks and some bigger trees we don't want to take down. Um, at the same time, it has to be in such a way we can put the solar panels on the roof and take advantage of as much sun as we can. Um, hopefully in the coming weeks, or by the time you see this, the shell will be built. Um, we're getting that prefab just a lot quicker and they can put it up in a couple days where me doing it by myself would take way too long so we do have that going up soon um, which is the roof the siding the slab on grade that we'll be doing um, and then soon after that our rough ones will happen with the electrician um, running his wires and uh, the plumber doing his rough in as well and at that point I'll move up here and start building um, should take I'm estimating about two months to finish the inside from insulation onwards basically. Um, so yeah, if you want to follow along on this build, it will be an off-grade. We'll use solar and propane, um, so depending on your feelings towards natural gas, we are considering an off-grade. Um, yeah, if you want to follow along and see how that unravels in the coming months and see what the end product will be like, then subscribe and uh, yeah share with whoever you think might find this interesting as well. Thanks for watching and hopefully I'll see you soon.